It's your cats. Good morning. Good morning, morning, morning. Okay, so today we are making the much waited for chili. And I'm gonna try and call it chili for the whole episode. All week long I'm talking about it, I'm like, you know, the curry room. No, it's chili, this is chili. Okay, so what we have here is we have about two cups of red kidney beans. We have one cup of uh, black beans. We have one cup of navy beans. We have one cup of black eyed peas. And then we have one cup of uh, white kidney beans. And we are gonna put half of all of this in here and we're gonna leave it uh, bean shaped. And we're gonna take the other half and we're gonna put it in here and we're gonna make a paste out of it. And we're going to then combine those things together. Dun, dun, dun. Also, dun. <laughs> And while that's going on, we are going to be putting our <laughs> the other things together. Oh my god, I can talk. Okay, all right, so we have the equivalent of one large onion here. Uh, so for those of you who are using rehydrated onions, that is four tablespoons of onion that you've rehydrated. Then we have two tablespoons of coconut oil. We have uh, as much garlic as you feel like. I felt like five cloves of garlic. Uh, you can use none if you're allergic or like I said, as much as you like. All right, then we have half a cup of dextrose. Now if you're at home and you're using table sugar, uh, dextrose is about half as sweet as normal sugar. So if you're using tables, just regular table sugar, cut that in half. <laughs> cut that in half because otherwise you're gonna have something that tastes like candy. All right, then we have here, we have about one fourth of a teaspoon of uh, chili powder. Then we have one half of a teaspoon of uh, parsley. We have one eighth of a teaspoon, uh, or actually no, one sixteenth of cayenne. Then we have one eighth of a teaspoon of turmeric. We have, oh, hang on, that's the cinnamon. Having a moment here. Once again, once again, it's about one eighth of a teaspoon of cinnamon. This is our chili powder. I'm like, wait a minute, this looks different. This was the chili powder. This is the chili powder, and we're at half a teaspoon for what I'm looking at here. Uh, like, and the spices are kind of fluid. You can add more spice if you want it to be spicier. If you want, you can add less if you don't. Uh, so that is, see, it's okay. It's okay. Sometimes I have moments. All right, and then we have something I'm adding that is kind of cool. Uh, this is like Indian parsley. It's uh. Oh, it's camp. The name, the name keeps escaping me. It's like, it's, it's, it tastes like parsley on the front end and then on the back end, it's got a little bit of bite to it. And I will, after we've got everything set up, I'll get, oh, ooh, actually, could you deliver me the box from upstairs? It's the one on the top shelf of the spice thing. It's the, it's, it's those little bag in it. <laughs> and uh, I will cover what this is actually called. Cause it's a, it's really cool. I didn't, I uh, didn't discover this until we started making curries and stuff like that, but it is a really nice spice. Okay. And then we have about half of a teaspoon of grains of paradise. And for those of you at home who are like, I don't have any grains of paradise. Or if you're not actually allergic to black pepper, you can just use black pepper instead. For those of you who are allergic to black pepper, grains of paradise is win. It looks like black pepper, tastes like black pepper. It's not black pepper. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, so we're gonna start getting started here. We are going to begin by dun 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 half spoon to low. And we're gonna start warming this up. So we are going to put this at medium heat and then and then and then and then we're gonna let that begin to do what it needs to do. Now I am gambling that all of this is going to fit into this. <laughs> Maybe you're on. Maybe you're on. It might not all fit. Okay, but I have hope. Have hope, and then it's what matters. Of course. And quite, and quite, and quite. And I'm just gonna try and not make a huge mess with the rest of it. You're like, you're gonna make a mess, bro, sis. Today is a mess making day. You're probably right. You're probably right. Let's get our cloth that we have already set up. I anticipated messes. Okay. There we go. Half of that is in. <laughs> the white beans got a little frozen in the fridge last night. Oh, that's beautiful. All right, we're going to take out the half that we can't get out. <laughs> okay, alrighty, 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 alrighty. Alrighty. Yeah, we are, we are, we are, we are. There we go. As we once again, clean it up our mess so it doesn't get all over our countertop. You're like, it's going to get over the countertop anyway. Let me dream. Let me dream. <laughs> I have a dweeb. I have a dweeb. And in my dweeb, this thing's actually works the way they're supposed to. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Again, half of the navy beans. 
in the middle. Move it over here. Move it over here. There we are. Check, check. And Koi, being in a bowl again. Huzzah! Huzzah, huzzah, huzzah. The ice cream is all on the side. Looking nice, 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 nice. That was fantastic. And Koi, okay, okay, okay. Half the black beans coming in. Meow, 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 it's a convenient thickener for the glory and wonder that is the chili. So, keep the goop. Keep it. Keep your goop goopy. Meow, meow, meow. You're like, but do I have to keep my goop? You do! You do! Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Take care of that. And then, and then, and then, and then. And then. Okay. Okay, okay. Now we're going to end up using probably roughly about two cups of water. When all is said and done. I'm going to put a little bit in right now. And we are going to begin the process of uh, creating our puree. Meow, meow, meow. Extra meow on the side, get us a little, a little plate so I stop making a mess of everything. There we go. There we go. There we go. Huzzah! Huzzah! Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We've got the lid to our blender. Make sure it is secure. Those of you following along at home, here we go, here we go, here we go, and put it on low, and you're all good. Okay, and the reason why we're pasting it is because this half is for thickening and this half is for, for texture, right? All right, next step. Next step, in goes our onions. Pulling in. Pulling in. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, could you grab me the, uh, okay, the, that box of spicing on the top shelf of the spice cupboard? I wanted to tell everyone what it was and I can't remember its name. I was all like, yeah, I don't remember the name. Got nothing. And boy, as my boy, can't return this down while we have more stuff. So we're down to uh, meat, uh, half of medium, medium low. So I don't want to overcook your onions. They're like, cooking them? When did we start cooking? I'm like, what am I pronunciation? All right, yeah. And do we want to do it? And do we want to do it? Uh, oh no, 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 like like that one box. It's the paper box on the very top shelf. The one on like the the right hand side. Right, you go pick it. That's making a I was all like, but yeah, no, it's, it's the one that, or you could just read me the thing, because it's like it's the. The name, the name, it's, it's like, it's like, I can't remember it's name. <laughs> it's, a, it's the, it's the box of spice, like it's an actual box and it's the, uh, it looks like parsley, but isn't. Okay, 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 that one gets trimmed on the thing. Mm -hmm. As a woo, as a woo, woo, as a woo, as a woo, woo, as a 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 woo, yeah, no, I can't remember. Yeah! This is tough. Okay, so yeah, it's a kid's name. It's Kasuri Methi. I cannot remember. Like like I said, I'm probably pronouncing this wrong, but this is really nice. Thank you, Mom. It tastes like, uh, okay, so it's the front end tastes like parsley, but the back end 
gives it like a, a burn undertone. It's really cool. Uh, there, there, there. And uh, and you can get it in giant boxes. <laughs> and it is, uh, I said, I hadn't discovered it until we started making the curries, and I was like, oh, what is this? And it's really nice. So we're adding it on top of the parsley. It's also got like a little bit of a celery flavor. So if you're in a pinch and you're all like, God, I don't have any celery, and you're making something that's spicy anyway, you can toss that in and it'll give you that, that, that fresh flavor that celery has without, you know, having to actually be celery. <laughs> Which is really nice. But yeah, name-wise, I got nothing. I got nothing name-wise. Keep going. So yeah, so we've got about a teaspoon of that going in. Now, that is an optional one. You do not have to add it if you don't have it. That is cool. Like I said, I only discovered it recently. And this curry recipe predates, or not curry, this chili recipe predates the, uh, the curification. And it didn't work. Incline, 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 incline. The curification? Oh, no! Oh my god, I forgot to put up all my damn announcements. No! Okay, you guys are gonna have to give me a second. I'm gonna turn this down. I'm gonna put up all. Ah! Okay. Alright. We're at one, so it's still staying warm. I'll be right back. I forgot to post all the things. Ah! We're laughing, nobody knows. No, one knows. Nobody knows. Damn it. I wasn't supposed to post Everything is fine. All right, you're like, is it? No, it is not fine. We're gonna work with it anyway. It's fine. Okay. Like I made it Just back up, back up to medium heat, guys. <laughs> hi, 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 Donut King. <laughs> Stay with. Oh, you're doing all your tidy. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, I'm gonna move our foot over a little bit. Okay, 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 okay. And yay, I posted all the notifications saying that we're live. It happened. It happened just now. I made like a cute meme. I'm like, why well, make it be cute? You can remember it, but like, but I was like, it's extra cute. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I thought it was kind of adorable, and uh, and I was like, oh, and no one may have ever seen it. A woo, a woo, a woo, a woo, all new woo. Hey boy, hey boy, hey boy, hey boy. In goes our spices. Hey, it's the morning. 
I hope y'all like the meme. I just put it up for you. Just for you, just now. Oh, woo. Oh, woo. I thought it was really cute. I thought it was really cute. I made it special. Well, once again, once again, we think it's special every day. This is true. But I made it special. <laughs> I made it special for, for the chili. For I don't like, like, because you know, magic chili. Eh, eh. I was like, yeah! <laughs> it's gonna be really adorable, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> so good morning. Good morning. And question of the day. Question of the day is very on topic. So what do you all do to help you remember things? Because apparently I need pointers. <laughs> I made special meme. It's really cute. I made a very special meme. It's adorable. It's. It, you could say it's very transformative. <laughs> Meme, meme, M E M E, and that special meme. <laughs> oh, man, 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 man. I put it, okay, it's, uh, check the Discord. Uh, it's in the live channel. In the live channel, it's under the video. It's also on Twitter and all the places, all, all the socials. But yeah, no, I'm, I pull it in the live channel every day. Every day I make a new one. As do we this one was today. I thought it was really cute. <laughs> like, Daisy, if you remember, it's usually up. For the next day, you know, it's doing things like, I don't have a special strategy for remembering things. Thank you. Thank you so much. In this case, like, I can't help you. Sorry. Sorry. For as much as I would love to be able to be like, yeah! Nope. Okay, 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 so we are just waiting for the onions to change the, their scent a little bit. Uh, I'm looking for them to become fragrant. It's not like they are cooked before we move on to the next place. And the reason we're doing this is because that shortens the amount of time it takes to cook your chili significantly. Because uh, raw tasting onions, you can taste all the way through a chili. You're like, mmm. Whereas if you... What are you trying to remember? To get all my stuff done for like, like I made a checklist. I made it to like actually do it. Did you do this? Did you do that? I'm like, okay, I did the sound check. We got everything set up, prepped the music, da da da, wrote all the blurbs, put them on the thing, did that. I, I did everything except put them the places they're supposed to go to let people know that we're live. Oh you catch Oh no, you need some you need a remember all to help you remember the things that you do to help you remember things. I completely understand. Completely understand. But, but yeah, no, I'm trying to remember to do all the stuff I'm supposed to do in the morning. Like, check this out. Make sure the green screen is off. Set, put out the blurbs. Did you send the memes? Did you have tea? Did you wash your face? Are you dressed? Like, <laughs> do you have all the ingredients? <laughs> Little chores, alarms on my phone. Oh, cool, cool, cool. That, yeah, this is looking good. Starting to smell cooked. That is happy. All right, so now we're gonna take, you guessed it, the rest of these guys are going in. Number one, check. Number two, going in. Turning the heat down to medium low. We don't want this to burn. And Already, 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 already. <laughs> Every day, fair, fair. That is true. That is true. And it, 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 it's a. So what you're saying is we need to form a habit. <laughs> you think by now I'd have it though, right? Right? Ew, come on, come on, come on, come on. And goes. This one's. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then. Ankle. And then last but not least, uh, we've got all these guys popped in here. This one. Oh, actually, we're going to give it a second. That's going to do the thing. It's had some time to sit, so we're helping it out a little bit. And then in she goes. Oh, it all fits! 
Yes, I wasn't sure it was gonna. <laughs> Dangerous! Okay, 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 okay. And coin, and coin, and coin, and coin. And because, okay, something to be aware of when you are making chili is that stuff like this, I know, I know a lot of people like to let stuff like this soak overnight. Do not do that. Um, chili beans left out on the counter go bad exceptionally fast. Like, oh my god. So if you were to leave this to soak overnight, tomorrow morning you would walk into your kitchen and you'd be like, oh, what is that terrible smell? And that smell is the, uh, the beans that you left to soak overnight. Don't do it. Never do that. Never, ever, 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 because you will have regrets. And I'm speaking from personal experience. All right, so we're going to soak this right now, and then it'll already go into the washer. Because, yeah. Now, some stuff you can get away with waiting on. Other things, no. <laughs> and this one is definitely on the list of, of nopes. A triggering word that you usually use before doing the activity. Okay. Oh, no, that makes sense. It's kind of like creating an anchor point. I got you, Totem King. Uh, to think. Well, I meow, but I meow a lot, so you regret nothing. <laughs> I have regrets. I have regrets, and my regrets involve, I guess, same deal with, like, the chili bowls and stuff like that. When you eat it, do not let that soak over it. Just, just don't. Don't. You get, give it a rinse, make sure it's all out, and then if you want to, like, leave it in the sink, you can. But get all of the bean out of that, or you will regret. Regrets will have regrets. Also, it will be regrettable. So yeah, so, so that is my my quick morning for you guys. It's uh, you, you can't do it. You can't. Oh, I forgot the big spoons. It's okay. Okay. Now the other thing you need to be aware of when making a chili is uh, you are now on babysitting duty. That's right. You all get to walk away now. It's in the pot. Uh, welcome to your new best friend. <laughs> at least until it's finished cooking. Uh, because if, I keep saying, oh, we gotta cut that word out, where it's gotta go. Oh, but I, okay, but I gotta make the tea very first thing. Like the very first thing I do in the morning is make the tea. Like I have, like I, I, I crawl out of the bed, right? And either, either mom has very kindly already boiled the water for me and there's like a little tea bag sitting in it, all I have to do is add sugar, or, or I crawl over the microwave, I stick my teacup in with the water in it, and I go boop. And then, and then at that point, I start gathering up the ingredients for the food, right? So we need, like, maybe, maybe, like, when I walk through the door downstairs, like, or, like, or when I go to, like, okay, the thing that I do right before we start to do, like, like, actually, like, the typing and stuff like that is I turn on the computer, I guess, logically. Uh, <laughs> well, oh, every time. Oh, oh, okay, so every time I make tea, what do I need to remember? Interesting. Now, we are also going to be adding salt to this, but, but, salt is a personal preference thing. So we've got our salt here, and we're going to add it a spoonful at a time until I'm satisfied with it. And you are going to do the same at home. Do it, add it a little bit at a time until you have an amount of salt that you're like, yeah, this is nice, I like it. And then that's what you're gonna do. No, that's fair, it's not too often because like I only, we only have what, like four cups of tea throughout the day? Roughly, <laughs> roughly four, because we have the two caffeinated ones in the morning and then either two or three of the peppermint throughout the day after that. Or sometimes we have three, okay, five cups of tea a day. We're gonna say five, it's roughly about five. Uh, sometimes it's three caffeinated and two non-caffeinated. Sometimes it's, you know, three non-caffeinated and two caffeinated. But it's always at least two caffeinated because uh, we've learned our lesson. <laughs> two cups of caffeinated tea away a day keep the migraines away. Uh. <laughs> and okay, 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 okay. Okay, turn this up again. All right, yeah. Now, the reason why you are now welded to this beautiful, beautiful thing is because it will burn to the bottom. Uh, chili is really, really persnickety. It is extra persnick with persnick. Uh, so, like, once you have started it, you are committed. You are here, and this is, this is the thing. If for some reason you have to take a potty break or something like that, turn the heat off. Like, just turn it completely off if you have to step away from the pot. You can always turn it back on again. It's not going to, like, lose the overall heat, but you're going to prevent it from burning. Uh, and it is. 
All right, sounds good. Enjoy your dishes. Enjoy your dishes. But yeah, so uh, so this, this is, these are the tips, the hacks. These are the chili hacks, because you need them. You need them, you need them, you need them. Because without them, without them, they're, you'll be like, oh, I made this beautiful, it's burnt, it's burnt. Okay, now if you do burn your, your chili, which does happen, um, because, because you forgot to turn it off when you walked away or whatever, um, you can salvage it somewhat. What you do is you take it out, all of all the salvageable bits out, you put it in a new pot, then you, you cut like some potatoes into large chunks, you throw them in, and they will absorb the burnt flavor. It still won't be perfect, it won't be the same as if you like actually, you know, did it right the first time. But it you will you will take it from being burnt and inedible to you know something that is edible. So that's so you're like I don't want to waste it all. Like you can't do that. It's very important that you change pots for that because otherwise the burnt stuff on the bottom is still going to be adding that horrible burnt flavor to what you're trying to remove the burnt flavor from. So it's like counterproductive. So you need you got to do chili. These are the laws to chili making. <laughs> So just ease it's easier to just babysit it or maybe get one of those little like like I've seen them on TV where you've got like that little dinosaur that's got the little feet looks like come bagly like the Loch Ness monster you put it in a pot and like throughout the cooking process it just twirls I, I would love one of those they look so cool uh, but but yeah it, like that might that might save you having to like sit sit there and like eyeball it the whole damn time mm -hmm. Excel gestures like, wait, is that another splurge purchase I can add to the Wawa? Wawa. Everyone's like, what? It's, it's a long story. Join the Discord. You had to see the conversation about the Wawa. Yeah, it's a, multiple conversations about the Wawa, actually. It's beautiful. It is a meme that sparked a legacy. And then self-denial. And then, you know... And then glorious and wonderful self-actualization. <laughs> All right. But yeah, so see how we've got like, okay, so we've got like a really thick paste, but we also have our chunks. Now something else for those of you who are like, I want to add tofu. Okay. Okay, but not now. Same same with those of you who are like, um, I'm not a vegan or a vegetarian. I want to add meat. Okay. But not now. <laughs> What we do is we make the base completely vegan. This does a few things for you. One, if you have company coming over who's a vegetarian or a vegan, and you're like, oh no, what can I serve it? Well, you've got this, It's because this freezes. You can put this in the freezer, and it will last forever in the freezer, right? And you can just pull it out, put it on a better ice, and then like, look, completely vegan for you, enjoy. And, uh, and you didn't have to do any extra effort. Two. Uh, the tofus, the the meats and all that stuff, they affect the flavor. They affect the flavor. We are creating a base that is beautiful and delicious all on its own. And then if you want to add protein to it at the end, when you go to plate it, you can. <laughs> you absolutely can. That is when you add the protein. That is when you add it at the very end, when you're like, okay, I want to put some steak on it. Okay. I want to put mushrooms in it. Okay. Want to add tofu? You do. You. <laughs> like, that is when, that is when, for, but for the, for our base, base curry, all we are doing is making sure that we have something that is going to harmonize wonderfully with whatever it is that you stuff on it to add extra protein, assuming you do that. Like, some people are going to be like, but I just want to have it the way it is. That's okay. You can do that too. <laughs> I still don't understand this self Ha ha ha. Fair. Fair, fair, fair. Okay, so now we're just waiting for it to come to a boil. Soon, TM! It'll get there eventually. It'll get there eventually. We're back up to medium heat, guys. And, uh, and yeah. So, so like I said, we're, we're making this so that it can stand on its own, and also so that if you want to add something to it, you can. Like, it, it pairs well with everything. I've paired it with tofu, I've paired it with uh, rabbit, I've paired it with, um, bear with me here. As you move the meaty things, I've paired it with mushrooms, I've paired, like, I've tried it, like, I've had it with many, many things, and it pairs with everything. So it's really nice, it gives you maximum flexibility for whatever it is that you want and whoever you're serving. Because, 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 you know, you want to be... Why do I keep saying it? Self, I have questions, I haven't said that at all. Uh, we've talked about 
We've talked about chili regrets. <laughs> you know, we haven't talked about that. I have questions. I have questions, Axel Jester. Okay. What, did, what, 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 I don't get it either, so it makes you feel any better. And I'm glad, glad you don't get soft out. Well, you should feel confident in yourself. A koi, a koi, a koi, a koi, a koi, a koi. So we're just waiting for this to warmeth the apasa. Meow, 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 extra meow on the side. Oh, <laughs> yeah! No, I thought it was funny, right? Because you were denying yourself the purchases before, and so, and so I was assuming that aside that the other stuff on that list that you showed, aside from the wawa, were other things that you had denied yourself in the past. So, so it was your end of self denial sale because you're like, okay, I'm buying all these things that I wanted for a while, get them today. That was that was my. Yeah, so not, not a damn thing. Denial. Denial, which uh, is a river in Egypt. <laughs> You're like, uh-huh. 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 <laughs> Thank you. I'll be here all day. <laughs> oh, that's fair. That's fair. Well, it doesn't say, you know, with the reason why you were preventing yourself from buying it prior. It's fine. It doesn't matter why. Just like, you know, you're, you're, you're in a better place now. <laughs> Why do you sound like we're at my funeral? No reason. No reason. No color. Color, 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 color. Also, when you're making chili, I suggest dark clothing. Because there's going to come a point where this starts to kind of spit a little bit. And you're going to want to be able to just, like, wipe whatever it is off of you. Um, so, like, yeah, dark Dark moving. Dark moving for the wind. This is not a wear white kind of day. It's a Zora black day. Zora, you got black. Get your apron on, do the good stuff. Meow, 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 meow. Okay. And then just be patient. Be patient. Now, you don't have to use a wok. I'm using a wok so that you can like see more of the inside. Which is why I was like, I don't know if it's all gonna fit. Normally I would use like a stock pot for this. I have a big one. I have a big one. Like we're making a smaller version of the recipe I normally make. Normally I make like... <laughs> Every day is for a white day? Oh no! 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 Is it? <laughs> yeah, unless it just doesn't come out. Said, and we're just keeping an eye on it, giving it the stirs, waiting for it to do the cooking cookie. The cookie doo 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 doo. Oh, and if you don't have a blender or food processor, you can use a potato masher to mash them down or an electric whisk. Like you, you've got options. He doesn't have to. He doesn't have to use that if you don't have one. It's just that one is the. That is the fastest way. Uh, you put it in. You press button. You go go, <laughs> and it's like, Rrr! and then it is done. <laughs> well, it just means you need a lot of sulfites in your diet, yeah. And mustard is tasty. It's weird, the difference in flavor between, like, mustard powder and your store-bought yellow mustard, like, your stamp, like, I, because they, they taste nothing like, <laughs> nothing. Like, you go to make mustard at home, and you're like, what do I have to do to this to make it taste like that? Because, uh, these are not the same. Because <laughs> they're not the same. What the frick? What the ever-loving frick? Because, yeah, shocking. Like Dijon mustard and mustard taste the same. Like you're like, okay, all right, yeah, that's that that's, that is the same that is the same flavor. I get it. We added like water to it and they take you know, it's a yeah. Our adventure in mustard baking. Our adventures in mustard baking have been an interesting journey and like what the what? The heck? The who? Huh? Yeah. 
Oh, oh, okay, and remember, tomorrow, tomorrow is making videos day, so I will not be live tomorrow. Tomorrow I am going to make shorts. I'm going to make a whole lot of shorts. Maybe some full lengthy things. But, but I'm going to be making stuff all day. So send, send me energy, send me love, send me, send me stay on task. Send me stay on task, because, uh, because the temptation when, when you're not, like, live and chilling with everybody, or at least, at least my temptation is to, like, do house chores. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hey, I've got some free time. Let's get some house chores done. It's like, no, no, you must make the videos. Yeah. We can do the house chores after we make the videos. The videos have to, they must come first. They must come first. So, so yeah, so, so please, please tomorrow, send love, send, please stay on tasks, process. We want to see the videos. Because, because, yeah. Uh, a list of the things, oh, you mean in the morning? Or are you talking about the videos? Because the videos is just like I have like a whole bunch and I just have to like, I've got the drafts already prepped, I need to cut them. I need to cut them into into thing, put music to them. And then I've got a few more that I need to review. What are we talking about in the morning? Oh, a song for me in the Oh, okay, so yeah, that's the, okay. That would help me remember. Putting it to music, that would work. That would absolutely work, Excel Jester. The morning, yeah, no, that would... Yeah, yeah, no, that's, that is how I remember my ABC, so that would totally function. <laughs> they really are. Like, uh... <laughs> they really are. Like, make a song about it. It's like Mississippi. Am I a Mississippi? <laughs> it's like that. That's that's how we got the spelling of that one down. As if we. Although it's more a chant now. It's like, am I a you? You like. Where's the sacrificial dagger? I feel like I feel like we should have one and like a goat or something. <laughs> oh, me and me out. Except it's okay, because we don't need an exorcism. So it's <laughs> oh my god! Okay, so this morning when I was typing out the meme, I was all like, did I spell that right? And I put it in Google, and Google didn't give me like any spelling errors. I was like, maybe it's just the sentence is too long. And I, I was like, no! Oh, I spelled the whole thing right! I'm so proud! I am so proud! Proud! I got transformative right on the first go. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, baby! <laughs> Meow! Oh, did you like it, by the way? Did, did, did you look for it? Did you, did you like, did you like, is, did you like it? Was, was good? Was it good? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Doesn't it? All the cat statues. I was looking for cats and, and chili, and I was like, all right, see, is there a cat like eating chili? Is there one like making? And then I saw the cat statues. I was like, wait, wait, wait. I can work with this. I can work with those cat statues. Little, little, little chili pepper whiskers. I was like, oh, it's so cute. I was like, okay, now in an alternate dimension, someone has fed their cats magical chili, and it has transformed them into chili statues. <laughs> Um, no one has suggested it, but I've been thinking of it, because that would probably, like, I need to find a good one, because that would probably work way better than my searching the internet every day to find more cat pictures, because eventually I'm going to run out. <laughs> eventually I will have found all the cat pictures. Um, but yeah, and if we used an AI to make it, then, then we, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think, I think that might be helpful. We could... Do you have a specific one in mind, Excel Jester, that you think would be good? You just use baby Oh my god, baby. Oh, oh, they still my heart. Oh, baby. I just Google. 
Vem! <laughs> oh, man. You have explored much. Ah. Oh, no, no. Okay. Okay, good. We have our tasting spoon. This is important. We're going to start eating it soon. I'm starting to see simmering happen. That is starting to see it move on its own. So that is good. This is good. This is good. Enough. Also, uh, when you're picking out what spoon to use to do your chili with, you want something with like uh, some little spoon shape, but you kind of want like a straight edge on the bottom that's got some flex to it. So like, ah, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, spatula, spatula esque, but not like like I said, like like count spoon chili here, or like one of those ones that's kind of got the curved edge. I don't remember what they're called. You know, the, like they like I genuine. It's, I completely every time I look at it, I'm like. I don't know what you are anymore. I used to know your name a long time ago. But you know where people, where they used to like put stuff on the top of cakes with and stuff? Like it's the, it's, it's, a pa it's paddle shaped. Usually they're made of silicone. But, but yeah, you want, you want the one that, the, the ones that are shaped in a way that you can use to scrape the bottom of your, your thing. Cause, and like I said, their name escapes me at this moment. I can't remember what they're called. They're not. Like, like this one's great because it's a spoon and, but the, but if you have a choice between like the straight edged one and a spoon, go with the straight edged one, because you can always get a tasting spoon, right? <laughs> you don't, you don't need this part to be a spoon. But, well, Count Spoonchula is awesome. Don't get me wrong. Count Spoonchula is amazing. Uh, the Awu. You like the Awu? Yes, the Awu. The Awu is a beautiful. Okay. Okay, now something else to be aware of with uh, chilies is uh, the magic that happens when you place them in the fridge overnight. Your chili, your your chili on day one is going to taste awesome. It's going to taste good, right? But day two chili that has had a full evening of all the ingredients like uh, co-mingling and like harmonizing with each other is like next level amazing. Uh, it's it is one of the few foods that is better as a leftover than it is the first time you have it. Like it just is. Uh, so it's so just be aware. Just be aware. Your curry or not your curry. Your chili today is gonna taste good. Your chili tomorrow is going to taste phenomenal. <laughs> and it's just it's just one of, one of the little facts of uh, uh, chili. And once again, you can freeze it. You can make a big batch of it. Portion. Uh, what I what we like to do is make the big batch and then portion it into like one cup portions and then stuff those in the freezer or two cup, one and two cup portions, depending on like how much you, how much you want to have on a thing, stuff that in the freezer. And then for, for now, until you run out, whenever you want some chili, just grab one of those and you can stuff it in the oven and bake it. You can microwave it. You can put it on the stove top. You, all of those work. You put, you're like, you, you, okay, your nose is itchy. It is a little bit. But yeah, all of all of those options will work to get you the glory and wonder that is glory and wonder. <laughs> okay, 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 because I'm starting to see the movement. We're gonna do a taste test. I'm gonna see how much of this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyway, anyway, okay, okay, okay. Anyway, it is time. It is time. And once again, once again, this is half a cup of dextrose. If you are using normal table sugar do you a quarter because that is significantly sweeter than this is um a stick I guess if you've got a little bowl on that stick sure <laughs> I'm assuming you meant stick I guess putting it on a sack I don't know how it worked but uh, you can give it a go. Imagining some sort of glass tubing over a campfire where you warm it up in the middle and then like suck it out with a straw. See that happening. Mm -hmm. Now you can sneak extra things into here if you want to add extra nutrition. Like if you've got spinach powder, you can throw it in. No one will ever know it's there. Um, and it will add extra iron to the meal and stuff like that. Uh, same deal with, uh, you can add a little bit of beet if you want to like give it a more rich red color. But all of these are options. We're not doing that this morning because we cannot run in the bowl. Um, okay, you did mean stay. I figured, I figured, this wasn't 100% sure. Mm. 
Good boy! Have an amazing day at work, Excellent Tester! In boy, 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 as you're going to start. Got that sweet in there now? Mmm, it's a spicy bite. Yeah! Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Okay, and our first teaspoon of salt. So again, adding this a little bit at a time. A little bit at a time! Really easy to over salt things, and you do not want something that is overly salty. You want something that is going to be just right. Just happy, glorious, and wonderful. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Can you feel it? <laughs> I can feel calling at the end of time. Hold on, hold on. Meow, meow, meow. You go ahead. Okay, 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 okay. Mm-hmm. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's do our tasting. Mm. Okay, we might put like half a teaspoon more salt in. Okay, so we're at a teaspoon and a half. And if you're trying if you're trying to increase someone's like fruit intake and stuff like that, you can sneak in stuff like mango powder. Like you can get all kinds of you can get creative with with the chilies and get like all kinds of stuff in here if you like. Or if you read them in the list of ingredients, they'd be like, there's no way that's in here. You're like, oh, yes, there is. <laughs> yes, there is. I promise. I put it in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The reason why I'm not anything ex at. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> that one more. Okay. The reason I'm not adding anything extra fancy to this is because I want you to be able to follow along with this recipe with stuff you have kicking around the house. Don't want you to have to run out and buy the mango powder, or the spinach powder, or the beet powder, or anything else like that. So, like, here you go. You probably have everything, everything except maybe, maybe the Indian spice. Um, and for those of you who make a lot of uh, curries, you probably have that one too. So, odds are, odds are you have everything, everything that we put in this. Mm. Okay, let's give ourselves another taste, because this is almost done. Here. We are very close to being able to put this in our mouth. You're like, technically you're already putting it in your mouth. Accurate. <laughs> Accurate, but not what I know. Alright. Oh, and if you're looking to get like all fancy with it, you can toss pineapples in here. Pineapple chili is kind of fantastic. If you're doing that though, I would uh, adjust the amount of sugar. Because you won't need as much with the pineapples. Especially if you use the pineapple juice. Huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I like to drink pineapple juice. Me too, man. Me too. Sometimes, sometimes you gotta use it to cook. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're almost there. Is you woo? Is you woo? Okay, we are turning it down because I have to step away from it for a second. We don't want it to spit. Okay, you for sure. Okay, so we need a little bit more. Okay, we're 
writing about a tablespoon. There we go. Another tablespoon. Throw it in. And boy, turn the heat back on. <laughs> As you do, like I said, at this point, you are so close to it being done, and like one wrong turn can ruin it. So you got calm. You're really careful. Really, really, really careful. You are. We are at the finish line. We're at. We're at that moment where I get to like pour it over things and be like, yeah, it's done. Look at us, beautiful, beautiful. We are ready for our photo finish. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, another half teaspoon of the salt going in, so it puts us two teaspoons. Cleansing our palate. And then, 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 One more tablespoon, I think. One more tablespoon of this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're like, oh, you were living dangerously there. I was. Okay, there we go. More tablespoon. And that should do us. You're like, oh, is that again? That was the dextrous, guys. That was the dextrous. Mm -hmm. And pour, pour, pour. Perfect. Perfect. One more half teaspoon of salt and we're good. Alright, so two and a half teaspoons of salt. A half cup plus 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 two tablespoons of the glory and wonder that does the dextrose. And then and then and then and then and then we are good. Turning it off, giving it one last test. Mm. Mm -hmm. I am happy with it. And what? Getting ready to take these guys upstairs. And quite. This one is low ready. In a mess. Okay. Alrighty. And then, if you'll remember, this is the cornbread that we made yesterday. You hold it and I'll let it explore it. Oh, I'm messing it. Okay, I think I'm gonna, for the next one, I'm actually gonna hold the bowl over the thing. <laughs> terrible, terrible messes. Oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh huh. Here we go. Okay, so I'll be right back. I'm taking this one upstairs. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then. <laughs> And it looks like the third person is still asleep, so we are going to leave that one aside for later. And I'm gonna have this one now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this time, this time, I'm going to make less of a mess. Less of a mess. Mm -hmm. There we go. We have this puppy right here. Check, check. And coin. This one over here, cool. We are going to put away the things so that we can make our beautiful bow. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Step one, 
moving things out of the way. All right, in a second, I'm gonna show you guys how to make beautiful photos of your food so that you can share them. Be like, look, look what I made. Or, or in the all important, look at what I'm eating. Yay! And, uh, and she would enough. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, so give me a sec for clearing the area. Because step one to taking beautiful photos of food is having a nice, nice, big empty area for them to be in. Step two is of course cleaning it off, making it all nice and shiny. Sure. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Extra good on the side. And pull my new cord. Extra okay. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. I'm gonna clean off the counter. And then, and then, and then, and then, we take the photos. And then we eat the beautiful noms. And coin, and coin, and coin, and coin, and coin, and coin. Okay, so step one, like I said, clearing everything off. Get it out, so chest could be over here for a second. And coin, and coin. Okay, I can still kind of see you, but I won't catch everything as we go. <laughs> Alright, now, step two. Step to do it up. Actually, first, and then, and then dressing this here, making sure also that that's all nice and pretty, right? Because I want to make sure it's nice all the way around. There we be. Okay. 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 Step two. Step two. It's tilting it. So we are going to look over here, see what direction I want this to be. Hmm. Hmm. The outflank friend. Okay. Kinda. How does that look the nicest? As you will, as you will, as you will. Yeah, I like like this. And then and then and then we're gonna take these and we are going to pop it under here. Not so. Check, check, check. Like that. Ma'am. And then we're gonna turn this so that gravity actually makes sense. Because <laughs> otherwise we'd be like, I didn't just see it. How is it? How is it defying gravity? Because it's a rebel. <laughs> it is a rebel. Okay, and then clean off the outside of your bowl. Make sure, like I said, make sure your plate's all set up nice. Make sure you are happy with the situation you've got going on. Okay, they're like, yeah, that looks good. There, yeah, nice. Very nice. It looks beautiful. And then, and then, next step. Next step, portrait mode. Oh, 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 we have a little bit of that out there. There we go. All right, so we had to finish hiding our, our underneath. And that is just a pot holder that I fold in half. It's not fancy. You do not need fancy equipment for this. You can work with your phone and whatever you have in your kitchen. All right, next, portrait mode. Portrait mode on the phone, and we're gonna take six photos minimum. We're going to take three up and down like this, and then we're gonna take three on the side. And when you take the three on the side, make sure that this part's on the top. All right, already, already, already. Here we go. So our straight on photo, check. And then angled photo one. And remember, angled photos are win. The amount of times the angled photo has been the one that I was it's like, oh my god, it's beautiful! Look at it! Um, is high. <laughs> very, very, very high, so I do recommend that. And when you're taking the flat one, if you go like this, you're gonna end up with just the bowl and the bread. Which I still wanted a photo of, just in case. But yeah, so definitely, 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 definitely. There you go. There. Okay, that puts us at the full, full six that we needed, plus an extra one. And go and go and go and go. Then, then the moment we've all been waiting for, the cornbread! Cornbread! <laughs> it been since yesterday's boys. And go 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 and Beautiful, 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 beautiful stuff is. Okay, like, and I'm still not sure how well the cornbread is going to hold together. For <laughs> okay, so I buttered it, and, <laughs> and, the, and the butter held on. That's hilarious. Okay. You're like, what happened? The butter uh, stuck to the cornbread to itself. And it is, the cornbread was more attracted to the butter than cornbread was to the cornbread. <laughs> Mm. 
unconditional. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There we go. <laughs> We're gonna do it like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so unlike regular bread, the cornbread is not stable enough to hold the chili. The chili, thankfully, is stable enough to hold the cornbread, though, so we're good. Okay, like, I don't think it's supposed to work like that. It's fine. It's fine. You could say that this is how the cornbread crumbles. But yeah, no, nice combination. I'm really happy with it. I'm gonna salt it a little bit more, because, as you all know, I undersalt things so that other people enjoy them, too. And I salt them the amount I want to have. Well, we're done. <laughs> it's a point, a point, a point, a point. Extra okay on the side. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. <laughs> Got a little more bread in there. Meow. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. All nice and happy. Extra happy on the side. Now remember, remember, those dishes, you gotta get them done today. They <laughs> have to happen today. If you wait for tomorrow, you are gonna have regrets. Thinking the same thing, which which thing, <laughs> which thing, and and hi, good morning, good morning, the cheeseburger. How are you doing? Mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm. Mm All good. Work this. The cornbread, the salt. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that was a really nice combination. Uh, today, today we are we are slaying with dragons. <laughs> okay, so first we have a couple of rounds of Hearthstone in, and then we're gonna move into Gods and Chain, and then and then and then we're gonna use our Death Dragons to kill everyone. So we are. Hmm. Okay, if you're a dragon and you're a slayer, does that make you a dragon slayer? <laughs> Okay, let me know when they're over because it doesn't tell me when we're in the kitchen. I got nothing. Azuwu, 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 it doesn't tell me nothing. <laughs> okay, but it's only like 30 seconds, so it should be like any second now. Any second now. Are we back? Are we back? Tell me if we're back. Oh, it's like, <laughs> oh, not dragon. Okay, so, but, but yeah, so, so if you were a dragon and you were a slayer, are you a dragon slayer? <laughs> Nice, nice, we're back. Cause, cause yeah, cause we're gonna be slaying people with dragons. We're gonna be using dragons to kill people. That's happening. But we are not intentionally killing other dragons unless, you know, the other person has dragons, in which case we will kill their dragons. It's fair. All, all is fair in war and war. <laughs> ah, so you are a slayer dragon? It sounds weird though. Cause like, okay. Okay, so let, let's think about slaying humans, right? So if you're a human slayer, and you're a human, well, I guess we just call you murder. <laughs> like, murder! Murder! Or a serious killing, depending on how much, or, or in the military, depending on how this came about. Um, so we're a soldier. Um, So I guess our dragon now it really depends on if they are, you know, if they're getting paid to do it or not. <laughs> Is it your occupation? Oh nice! 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 I am glad. I am glad. Spicy is spice is nice. Uh, that was awesome. Oh, what kind of spice are you using on them? What if we ever called ourselves humans? We call ourselves human all the time. What are you talking about? Hot sauce? Okay, but what kind? What kind? Like, okay, so you got hot sauce. Is it like, is it, because there's so many kinds of hot sauce, man. There's like that sweet hot sauce, then there's like 
Then there's like brand specific, like <laughs> the fire in my own back is my favorite of like the hot sauces I've had to date. Live of like the little the little thing. It's a Tabasco. Is like what is it? Tell me about your hot sauce. <laughs> is it like the kind that you scoop out? You know when you're having uh, egg rolls and stuff like that. Your dip, like 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 the, the the hot chili oil, like 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 sweet on it. <laughs> No, some people like them. Some like it's bitter and hot. <laughs> a Cuban clerk. I, okay, okay, fair, fair. Because we call veterinarians, you know, animal doctors. Okay, okay, okay. So, so, so then, whether you're a dragon slayer or not, would would depend specifically on if other dragons are referring to you. Because <laughs> if you were, if, if, if so, so if the, the members of your own species are referring to, then you're just a slayer. But, but if it is another species referring to you, especially the afflicted species. <laughs> nice, nice. That's awesome. That is awesome. Because like, yeah, hot sauce is good. Okay. All right. So it is time for us to switch over to her stone and take this deliciousness with us, and. Your first boyfriend was a dragon? Nice! Nice. There are all kinds of jokes I could make, but they are all NSFW, and we keep this PG-13, so... <laughs> Slayer trick. Well, well, yeah, because, like, so it really would depend on... Okay, so give me a second. I'm gonna get switched around, and, uh, I'll, I'll, and I'm gonna make us more tea, apparently. Alright, so I'm gonna take this with me, and we're gonna get more tea. <laughs> Sorry! Sorry, it's just for my head wet. Okay. And hey, Ricky. Okay. All right. Bear with me here. We are going to update the speed.